21 this week is going to go on hiatus until after Labor Day. And until then, of course, the Olympics are going to take place. The Republicans and Democrats are going to be holding their conventions. The Maryland legislature is going to have a special session on gambling. So panelists, what is do you think is going to be the biggest political story that's going to be taking place between now and Labor Day that we're going to be discussing when we return in September? And Steve, you're first. It's going to be the, the, the uh, continuing um, crumbling of our economic picture. Uh, we're slowly sliding back into a recession, partly of our own doing and partly because of international circumstances. The conventions, the, the Democratic yes. convention and the Republican uh, convention, and um, I think it, it's pretty clear that for Romney's candidacy, the whole issue of likability continues to be a problem for him. And for Obama, while, pe while people like him, they're disappointed in some of the things that have transpired in his administration. Any wages on his Romney's going to pick since you're talking about conventions? For his vice presidential yeah. pick? I, I'm not really clear about that because, again, I don't think he's really done enough to establish who he is. What do you think is going to be the big story? Well, I think we'll be talking in September about who he picked as VP. I think we'll also be talking in Montgomery County about a very hot congressional race, maybe one of the hottest in the whole country, Delaney against Bartlett. I think that's going to be a real hot topic. And then we have these three ballot initiatives where people on both sides are going to be throwing fireballs. I think we're still going to be talking about the vice presidential pick. Um, you know, he, this is a, a, a key factor in the Republican success story if they're going to win, is they've got to pick the right person in the right way. They obviously didn't do that the last time around, so I think there's a lot of attention that's going to be paid to the vice presidential pick. The other thing that nobody mentioned, I think we're going to be talking about um, the special session uh, that the General Assembly is going to have uh, in the middle of August uh, on the gaming issue. And I think uh, we're going to see a potential debacle uh, in that process. Who do you think is going to be the vice presidential nominee? Puente is in play. Jindal's got a chance uh, for the governor in Mississippi. Yeah. No. Yeah, I, I, I think, think it's going to be Tim Pawlenty, the former governor of Minnesota. I think he's going to pick somebody really that we're not even thinking about. Mm -hmm.